Hi, we're here with Brendan Freeman. He's one of the winemakers here at Tavilk Winery. So, Brendan, what are we going to be doing today? Uh, we'll be looking at the red wine making process in particular today. Uh, in particular, some of our premium Shiraz grapes from our old vineyard, uh, the hand-picked fruit. Uh, we'll look at the uh, crushing to stemming process uh, through to the fermentation in our, our old world uh, red winemaking practice. Yeah. So it's a busy time of year for the winery? Very much so. Uh, we run 24 hours a day for uh, as much as 10, day, 10 weeks. Um, we've been known to go for as long as 12 weeks sometimes. Uh, uh, but this vintage in particular um, started quite early and we've, uh, we've been lucky to get the majority of the fruit off already so we may be finishing uh, the Okay, let's go and have a look. Very good. Uh, keep going. end of our Shiraz, uh, hand-picked old vines, uh, to be destined for our reserve label Shiraz. Uh, what we have here is our receivable bin. Uh, you can see with the hand-picked fruit there's a fair bit of um, stalks and stems still in amongst uh, fruit. Uh, so going through a crusted stem in here which will remove all of the uh, stalks and stems, everything that isn't uh, an actual grape. Get squashed in the process and then pumped straight into a, an open fermenter where we'll start the fermentation, uh, which will take approximately one week for our primary fermentation. And, uh, and with this fruit in particular, 18 to 20 months in uh, premium French oak barrels uh, before we blend it and bottle it. Emanuela here from uh, south of Italy. She's a visiting winemaker here to help us uh, with our 2012 vintage. And uh, what she's doing here is uh, what we call a pump over. So she's pumping the fermenting juice from the bottom of the vat over the top of the skins which are floating on the top of the ferment. Um, the idea here is to extract all the colour, flavour and tannin and everything that we want and a good full body Shiraz uh, out of the skins during the process. So we'll do this uh, twice a day for at least 20 minutes on each vat. So we'll have a few guys in here in the morning and again in the evening doing this pump over uh, each day for, for the week while the, while the uh, wine is fermenting. Okay, you guys. 